guys we need to talk so there was one of the person who basically asked me this question and i was very much confused and i i was 100% sure this is the prob this is one of the problem that you guys are also will be facing which is he asked me this question sir i am basically working as a software tester with x years of experience and can you please let me know if i am underpaid guys so in this video we are going to discuss about five important points how you can recognize if you are underpaid and what exactly are the solution and what exactly i have done and what exactly i know many people are actually doing so that they are not underpaid and they are earning good even as a software tester i know this is this is going to be a very important topic please understand this if you are a inspiring software tester as a fresher if you are from a non it person who want to switch to qa role or if you are a manual tester want to switch to an automation or anywhere right your salary will determine your growth trust me and let's discuss about this so first thing see the first point is that you have to understand the market salary range guys there are many websites i have discussed first one is glassdoor.com payscale.com linkedin salary right where you can basically find the salary range i have discussed this multiple time what you can do is go to linkedin salary search for the qa profile for how many years for example 2 years or something figure out a range there will be a range from lower band to upper band what you need to do is in the middle you have to go towards the right this is the most important thing that you need to do see for first to two years i can understand you can be underpaid but after two three years if you are a manual tester whenever somebody says no that promote sir i am a six year experience i have a seven year experience i have 10 years experience and i think i am underpaid i generally tell them bluntly i mean this is i generally tell them you are responsible for this because you have not done these specific things you have not added skills you have not added learnings and everything first of all you have not recognized that you are actually underpaid that is the one of the problem this pro underpaid problem is that you have not basically recognized that you are underpaid first of all if you have now recognized that i am underpaid right now you need to target some good product based companies to get a basically a good salary on this point right so number one thing is first of all recognize and see your salary range where you are with the number of experience that's the many most important part second important thing is guys always remember this is a very important survey which is already done if you are continuing in a same company versus switching you can always earn more whenever you switch this is i know this is very contradictory but i have even done it my friends have done it the person who is basically into a same company right after 10 years he is almost half then as compared to what i have done by switching into a better company companies see it is true for me maybe it is not for you but again this is a survey also done where switching is always helpful as compared to the same companies so i think there is a 3 years is a sweet spot where if you have, uh, after 3 years i'm pretty much sure all of you will become comfortable with the job it is time that you should switch to a better company where you get a good salary that is the exactly how you will not get underpaid even as a software tester i know it's a very important point right third important point talk to the friends about your worth this is very important this is what i have done also see when i was in essential right i was in essential i was getting almost like 3l or something right i used to talk to my people who are in product based companies who are working in a startup i can see uh, we have a similar experience but they are getting almost 4.5 there some of them are getting 6.5 i said both of us have a similar skills it is just that i am working in a simple mnc it means i will be getting half of the salary i will be underpaid because because in the same profile what's going on here right this is the most important you have to talk to your friends they will tell you that okay no promote you have the skills but it you are not present at the right moment that's what that's the problem is you are not present at a right place at the right moment that's the beauty of it so that's we have to recognize there will be there will be there will be a very good product based company which will give you a better opportunity better work better manager and also will give you a higher salary so look for that that's the most important fourth important point which is aware about the new trends guys if you think you are underpaid i think the most problematic thing that you are doing is that you are not increasing your skills you are not basically pushing your comfort zone this is the most important thing you know what when i was in wingify for 3 years right i knew that after 3 years i was clueless because i was not learning at all so it was a right time i thought okay i need to crack browser stack this is very important else i will not learn new things and all and i have planned properly for 6 month cracked a new job got almost like double of the salary in browser stack and that's how my process 
started so this is what you need to do aware that about the new trends aware about the new terminologies new company new product based companies who will always give you a better opportunity that is what you need to do you have to keep on looking remember this word keep on looking that's the important point in this case fifth important point is network with the people and discuss from the people who are earning good you know what when even as a working as a software tester i used to talk to a couple of friends i still remember i still have those numbers and all we used to talk about numbers okay what is your salary how much is it increase in one year two year whatever it is right and we used to talk about which companies actually giving the good packages and other thing right and it's a good thing you know what packages good packages good money uh, good money actually give you more motivation also to work this is what i believe also so if even if, if you believe this and there's no shame in that case somebody saying no 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 i will work, i basically work for passion i work for because i like the work trust me they are lying to you all of us are working for money this is what we have to do and if you are getting a good money automatically a good work will be uh, basically taken out from me this is my plan is okay so we discussed about what exactly they have done it how they have prepared for that high earning company what exactly they have followed right how they have planned switch right they, generally i have seen all the people who have good salary in software testing right they have properly planned a switch which means they have prepared for a company that they want to go even i have done it for the browser right that's what the most important thing so i hope you have learned something in the five important points i hope you are liking these kind of videos right and uh, one important thing if you want to increase your skills and all job ready automation tester july batch is started make sure you enroll and in the four months if you are a fresher non it person or even as a manual tester you want to scale yourself to the automation we are covering core java we are covering api testing with uh, postman rest assured we are covering web selenium we are covering ci cd plus not only that resume preparation everything it's a complete package for you to become an automation tester and not only that you will get uh, as the dot club access also where you will get referrals and questions 24/7 answers right very important things check out the link below about the all details i'll see you in the next video i hope you are liking this kind of videos comment down below how underpaid you are what do you think about this comment down below i will replying all the comments okay i'll see you in the next video bye